Like you would never be able to date that picture of like when it was. It's like yeah, what, <laughs> what era did this turn from? <laughs> when, when is that? Hello everyone, we're McFly and today we are gonna be reacting to our old looks. I don't know if we've ever had a good look. I can see some out the corner of my eye, but not <laughs> quite. Ah, uh, God. So should we crack on? This first one, the Capital FM Awards. 2004. So that was the, um, that features Tom's classic. <laughs> 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 At least I did like showing my teeth. So I think that was my go-to look, like pose, so I didn't have to smile with my teeth. Oh man, look at the state of us. Well, that was our first ever red carpet. You can really see the makeup. I mean, uh, the, our hairstyles are a little <laughs> bad. Really? <laughs> um, Danny's hair, have you ever seen straight hair? Okay, next picture. Tom and I are just giving a little flash of boxes. That to me looks still pretty sexy. I mean, they were just, they were like, wait, well, you get a, you get like a hundred boxes for five pounds from, from Tesco's, yeah. We don't look too bad there, do we? I don't I can't see through my hair. I don't know why we had it so long. Dougie, you've got the same, mate. Why, why do we have it so long? Right, Brits. Harry, your mullet is uh, at both of us. Uh, I d yeah, my mullet's pretty long there as well, isn't it? I mean, what is that? Mate, I like it. Proper Tiger King, mate. I love it. <laughs> I was trying to explain to someone at the weekend, Harry, your your mullet. They were like, "What? Why did he have a mullet?" And I couldn't really give them an answer because you knew that it was horrible. I think it's because suddenly one day I cut the sides and I was like, "Oh, I look better with it short in the sides," but I didn't want to get rid of the. That's how everyone ends up with a mullet. <laughs> Dougie, that's probably the worst your hair has ever been. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Japan was humid. It was humid. What size jeans have we got on? Man, you know how thin my legs are as well. <laughs> you lose a lot of room in those jeans. I'd love to get an x-ray if you want to at what point did I try them on going, yeah, they're a good fit. But I'd have got sign off from all you as well. Guys, what do they do? Yeah, cool, man. Yeah, but look at us. Look at who you're asking. <laughs> oh. That's a good point. Right, moving on. Just my luck, Premier. I like this. Yeah. Yeah, that's all right. For styling ourselves as well. That's pretty good. And the next one, I quite like that look too. Yeah, not bad. Yeah. Too cool on the beach. That was right before I got my hair permed around wire to, to give myself dreadlocks. Typical white dude from Essex goes to uh, Barbados for two weeks. He tries to look cool. Batman premiere, we're struggling there, boys. We're struggling. Danny, I think you're struggling the most, to be honest. I mean, that is shit, isn't it? A white shirt. And white problem. shirt and just... Grey jeans. Black sunglasses. BT Music Awards. We all look decent now. This is when we were, eat, we were eating almonds every three hours. Yeah, that's when we decided to like look after ourselves a bit. A little bit polished, a bit shiny. Yeah, a bit too polished maybe, a bit all saintsy. Spirit of London Awards. We kind of look like four accountants on a night out. <laughs> <laughs> Estate agents. For the same firm. <laughs> I look horrendous there. 2013 One Direction This Is Us premiere. We look a bit confused there, lads. I look like I could be in blue. Dougie looks <laughs> like he could be in Pirates of the Caribbean. Danny's having an absolute shocker. Why? I'm dressed like I'm dressed like Springsteen. I'm not. I like that. I'd wear that now. What are you on about? You get your chest out with that little pocket watch and your sleeves rolled up, your waistcoat. Christmas Horus launch. That looks like. Three students and their teacher. <laughs> yeah. So I, I was dressed smarter because it was my book launch. You guys and you guys all came separately, not as a band. So we are all dressed not as one unit there. I don't mind this look. It's okay. It's a little no, bit. Sure, a little bit not sure what we are, where we're at. But I think we weren't sure where we were at at that stage anyway. <laughs> no. That was recently. Harry's the only one there that's a little bit dodge. I know she's trying to get me back, so I've been tired to the photos. 
<laughs> there we go. I think my favourite is the um, T4 on the beach look. I like that as well, yeah. Probably the closest to where we are now. Nah. No, well, no, if you just slot you from the One Direction premiere into that look, then you're onto a uh... <laughs> <laughs> I like that look, so I'm in, mate. You look like Bruce Springsteen meets the Terminator. Meets the Terminator. Quite a good look. What's that, okay, if we've picked our favourite, what's our worst look? Is it, is it Japan 2005? For Dougie, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> But you would never be able to date that picture of like when it was. It's like <laughs> when could when is that picture? <laughs> Harry looks like you're in the seventies. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> what era is this band from? <laughs> when is that? Doug, cool tie, man. <laughs> you know, our manager made me wear that tie because I came down to the lobby to go to Live Eight, and he's like, "You got you got to go get changed, mate." I was, I was just wearing a t-shirt. I came down dressed like that and he's like, that's much better, Doug. Smart. <laughs> that's it. Yeah, that's... Well, that's it. Thank you, everyone, for watching us react to our classic looks. We've been McFly and we'll uh, see you soon. I hope you had a laugh.